as a denomination, the Four Square Church has a unique history that stems from missions and evangelism. It began as a powerful evangelistic movement and spread throughout the nations to become the global family it is today. On January 1, 1923, Sister Amy Semple McPherson held her very first church service at Angelus Temple in Los Angeles. But every day and every night, Jesus spoke to my soul, Now will you go? Preach! Preach! Preach the Word of God! Now, nearly 100 years later, we get to celebrate all that God has done in Foursquare in the U.S. and around the world. The Church of the Foursquare Gospel in the Philippines has its origins as a mission of the International Church of the Foursquare Gospel, which began in 1949. Everett and Ruth Dennison were the forerunners of a movement that was to spread all over the Philippines. And in 1957, the gospel has reached Tagum City through a three-night evangelistic crusade by the Thompsons and their team. Fast forward to 1978, the church was named Living Temple Foursquare Gospel Church. On its 66th church founding anniversary, we get to celebrate as well with the Foursquare International on its 100 years which continues to make an impact today to the many lives around the world. On our 66 years together, we live on what God has planned for us. We live on the dream and vision set before us. We live on His purpose for us. I had a vision, and the vision was a deep well. And that well, as I kept looking into it, it was deep, very deep. of Christ and this we believe Jesus Christ the Savior the baptizer with the Holy Spirit the healer and soon coming King we stand firm on the foundation set by Hebrews 13 8 which proclaims Jesus Christ is the same yesterday today forever.
Haleluya. Haleluya, haleluya. Let us pray. How could we ever outpraise you, O Lord, for all the wonders that you have crafted unto this temple? We even thank you for your gift, your son Jesus, who have been heading this church from the foundation of this temple, Lord, until now, and even until forever, O oh God. You are the same God. We bow our hearts before you, Lord, thanking you. Because you are a good God, a great God, a marvelous God. We remember our humble beginnings, O oh God. Those who have led this temple, Lord, the pioneering pastors, the pioneering members, O oh God. Lord, wherever they are right now, we just continuously pray that you still keep them in the hollow of your hands, O oh God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you that they have left us this sanctuary, O oh God. Thank you, Lord, for their efforts, not in vain, Father. Hallelujah, hallelujah. And we also lift up to you the present pastors, the present members, uniting together their efforts, O oh God, to give you bless your Lord, to honor you in this temple, O oh God. Bless us, O oh Father. May you stretch your arms unto them, unto us right now, O oh God, that each one will really feel that you never change, O oh God. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever. Amen. So right now, Lord, with gladness in our hearts, we just entrust to you the remaining parts of the service this morning. Thank you, Holy Spirit, that you will work in the lives of your people. Satisfy us, Lord, to overflowing. We do not want fame, O oh God, but we want you to be the famous person in this Call, oh God. Thank you, Lord. Oh, hallelujah. Right now, oh God, we just submit our lives to you. Do exactly what you want to do, Lord. You do it, oh God, for us. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, oh God. Nobody comes out from this sanctuary empty-handed, but we will all be victorious, filled, filled, satisfied with your word. Father, I pray, use your servant, O oh God. Use him to oh, mightily, O oh Lord, with power and authority that each one will be convicted that you are the God. You are the God who never change. Thank you, Lord. Oh, we give you praise, glory, and honor as we claim Jesus' victory in our midst. Hallelujah, we pray in Jesus' name. All of us will say amen. Hallelujah. Good morning, Living Temple. Are you ready to worship the Lord? Amen. Amen. In one, two, three. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, we declare today that Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Amen. Once again, shall we give a loudest clap of praise to Jesus? Hallelujah. It is a celebration of God's goodness. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We welcome the presence of God. Hallelujah. Oh, glory. Honor and praise belongs to you, Jesus. Amen. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wonderful God. Wonderful Lord. We praise you, Lord. We praise you, Jesus. Oh, we honor you, God. We honor you, Jesus. You're the same God. You're the same Lord. You're the same God. Oh, we praise your name. We praise your name. Offer your thanksgiving to Jesus today. Hallelujah. Oh, glory. Honor. Praise. Glory and honor to you, Lord. Jesus, you're a wonderful God. 
are wonderful, Lord. Oh, we thank you, God. We thank you, Lord. How wonderful you are, Jesus. How wonderful you are, oh God. We welcome your presence, Lord. We welcome your Holy Spirit. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Amen.
deserves our breath. He deserves our worship. Hallelujah. Oh, Jesus. We worship with one heart, with one spirit, with the same heart, with the same spirit. Let us be entwined with you, O oh God. Let us sing this for the same God that we serve.
of His faithfulness. It's been 66 years of His workmanship into our lives, repeatedly displaying His power, His miracles, His wonders into our lives, His provision, His love, His protection. We affirming time and again that He is the same God yesterday, today, and forever. The God of our forefathers, the God of Jacob, Isaac, and Jacob, Abraham, Jacob, and Isaac is the same God that we are serving, the same God that we're going to serve forever. In gratitude to all of the favor granted to us by our Lord for the entire year, we will be bringing this time our tithes and offerings, our mission pledges, our love offering to the altar. But before we will do this, let me have a prayer for everyone. Hallelujah. Wonderful, loving, and faithful Father, we thank you, dear God, for you are our God who is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Thank you, O oh Lord, for sustaining all of us. Thank you, God, for bringing us all here to celebrate our 66th founding anniversary. Lord, we are just so excited, O oh Father God, for the things that will be coming our way. We'll be giving our love, our tithes, our offerings to you, O oh Father, knowing, O oh God, that this is not from us. This is all from you, O oh Father God. We'll just be bringing back this unto you. And Lord, excited for more things to come, Lord, in this church, O oh Father God, to each of our family, O oh Father, that for the years to come, big favor, O oh Father God, and blessings will be poured out in the midst of this congregation, in the midst of this church. We just pray, O oh Father, for the hands that will give, O oh Father God, cheerfully and faithfully to you. Bless them, O oh Father God. Bless the works of their hands. Bless the family, O oh Father. Lord, provide each of the needs, O oh Father God. Meet all of them. Lord, we just pray, O oh Father God, for the uh, blessings that will flow and the Holy Spirit that will flow unto our needs this morning as we celebrate, Lord, our anniversary and Thanksgiving Day. We give you back all the glory, honor, and praises. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Requesting all our officers to come in front for our baskets, informing the congregation that as I call your name, uh, sorry, the month of your birthday, you'll be coming forward to do or to give your share. Are we ready, congregation? Ready? Okay. Come on down, January, February, and March celebrators. come in front the celebrators for the month of april may and june
next will be our celebrators for the month of August, September, and October. July, August, September, sorry. Can't correct it. Thank you for that. Celebrators for July, August, and September. for the month of October, November, and December. so much congregation for your faithfulness now i'm found by the father i've been changed from a ruin to treasure i've been given a hope and a future i've been blessed beyond all measure i am With the 66th founding anniversary, LTFGC presents a marathon of praise for a cause with the LTFGC worship team. We are so excited to have fun in worship with you all as we introduce a few of our original songs. As men, we are created to praise God, and as God, he exists to accept our true sacrifices of praise and worship. So grab your tickets now and join us in this night of worship. Invite your friends and see you all this evening at 6 p.m. 